right man to transform the Tigers. At the moment we're struggling, but I'm sure with Stan as the team manager, we should avoid relegation to the, from the third into the third division, and next season we'll start building the team up for the future. It never happened. City did survive in Division 2, but today they're back at the bottom, only one point from 15 over the holidays. What's worse, perhaps, is the number of goals the Tigers have conceded so far. So Turner's departure is not surprising, but he's still shocked by it. When I came to the club, they were bottom of the league, uh, miles adrift, and we managed to stay up. This time, another three or four results. Nine wins will keep them in the second division. And there are something like, um, I think, 21 games to go. So I don't see it being that, uh, that much of a problem. But it would certainly help if we could have um, a couple of players. If you analyse what Stan has spent since he's been here, I mean, I can't tell you, but he's spent somewhere six, seven hundred thousand pounds in, what, 14 months? So, we, I mean, so far he has had the players that he asked for. He wanted some more money, but I don't always think that money is the, is the answer. I mean, we've now got, what, 30 full-time pros on the books. Our wage bill's horrendous. We just haven't been able to thin out at all. This is where the discrepancy between you seems to be. He believes that perhaps with two more players, he would have been able to get a decent side together. Yes, but how, how many managers have you heard say that over the years? I just need another half million, Chairman. I mean, you know, let's be realist. We've got 30 full-time pros. I, I would not tell you our wage bill. You'd be horrified. We've got to thin out and then look at bringing people in. And unfortunately, Stan hasn't been able to do that. Perhaps caretaker manager Tom Wilson on the right can. His job is to lift the team for Saturday's FA Cup tie. Good luck to him, a difficult problem.